Praise God, praise God, praise God. Precious folk, this is your quintessential servant, the Holiness Revivalist, Reverend Kingsley George G. Ajman, Senior Pastor of House of Consecration Ministry, Accra, Ghana. Now, in the book of Psalm 23, the verse 5, the Bible said, Thou prepared a table before me in the presence of my enemies. I'd like you to know that even before the preparation of the table, even before the establishment of the table, your enemies were already seated. Your adversaries were already present. Now, the reason sometimes you feel disadvantaged in life, the reason sometimes you feel limited and restricted in life and in destiny is because of the presence of of your adversaries now it becomes very devastating and precarious when these enemies of your destiny occupy the advantageous side of your life for instance if they are occupying the educational side of your life you are finished you will discover that even the attempt to go to school i mean is almost impossible sometimes if they occupy the marital side of your life every relationship you enter for some reason, it doesn't graduate to marriage. Why? Because Satan and, and, and his cohorts are occupying the most advantageous part of your life. But the good news is that as much as you are limited, as much as you are restricted by, you know, your enemies, they can never restrict your inestimable father. God can never be limited. God can never be restricted, you know, by the enemies on your table. That is the more reason why this week, for once, I would like you to take your eyes from your enemies take your eyes from your adversaries why because it won't be long god will punish every one of those enemies with your testimony at the same table so take your eyes from them in pigeon we say j your eye or come out your eye from them and concentrate on the table why because the table represents your needs the table represents your desires the table represents the things you are yearning for the things you are gunning for in life and in destiny now how do you activate the table the bible said in luke 21 15 i have given you a mouth and wisdom that your gainsayers you know cannot resist you now how you activate your table is by speaking your needs now the kinds of needs you have determines the table you will speak for so if it is a house you are trusting god for start speaking the house if it is financial breakthrough start speaking it if it is a husband wife children start speaking your table of course the table differ from one person to the other my table may not necessarily be your table so when you read that scripture and you see table don't think the table there is talking of the one the carpenter made for you or the one you and your colleagues rally around to eat gobe or or some fufu no the table represents your heart desire and this week i speak by the power of the holy ghost that grace will come upon you so that you can speak forth your heart desire the table you are believing god for remember a close mouth is a close destiny i love you as always shalom god bless <music>